What's up? What's up? Good morning, guys. Welcome to the DraftKings DFS NBA segments for the slate of January 17, 2019. I go by Invisible DFS. Can you guys believe it? It's only been 17 days already. Since oh, man, those days go fast. Anyway, uh, let's go to segment one and check the night before. As far as the night before, guys. Uh, it was bad as far as for me it was bad uh, and the main reason is because of those Cleveland guys every single one of them did bad every single one of them basically did bad so and so the Rosen was bad Gay was bad Gordon was bad Arel was also bad based on his price and Sexton was even worse so uh, Basically, it's a bad call in all five players, but the good thing is there's always the next day because it's TFS, you know. So, uh, let's go ahead and jump to segment two and check the five players that are for you guys that have a price difference that is 1k or more. Let's go ahead and do that as far as the five players. Uh, Embed is 11.1k but only 10 point wait a minute only 10.1k in fd that's actually really really good and Siemens is 10.7 in fd but 9.2 it's expensive on both sides about 1.5k difference between the two sides but player only 6.8k i like that price uh 1.3k difference Ball also 6.4k regardless who ball is playing i like him he should see a lot of minutes the same go for engram uh if we 1k differences so those are the five players we're gonna go ahead and uh, of course go to uh the dk website so i can give you guys my three core players the cheap play and of course the star of the segment let's jump to the dk website to go ahead and do that all right, so uh, let's go ahead and get out my notes. The first guy I'm going with, the first guy that I have for you guys is Butler. At that price, it's probably, you know, it's the last time you played against in January, you only had 30 some fantasy points, I believe. We yeah, had 32. But he played 36 minutes, so that game should stay close because that's actually two good team. You know, one is more defensive minded, but Indiana is just and they're playing in Andy, so Indiana is just not. Indiana is basically pretty good. Indiana can beat them in any given day. So Butler is the guy I'm going for, and that's a guy that's gonna see a lot of minutes. They're gonna need them to play defense. So, uh, but there is the first core guy I'm going with. The second goal, core guy I'm going with is Alonzo, I mean, Ball. Alonzo Ball. Like I said earlier, Ball is a guy that's going to do a little bit of everything. Uh, he knows he needs to be aggressive for him to be better. And when he does, you know, that's a guy that can give you assists, rebound, even steal. And, uh, he doesn't even have to score in the 20s to get you some good fantasy points. So, ball with the minutes and everything else he can do is my second core guy. As far as my third guy, I have uh, a couple choice, couple of choice. You know, I have Bagley and I have Portis. So the thing about it, Portis is a guy I can design my cheap play. It's a 4.6, but sometimes I make the exception where I go over the 4.5 and then have Bogley as my third core. Uh, but also, Parker is a guy I'm looking at using as my cheap play. So, but the fact that is the fact that uh, Carter gonna be out, Parker is a guy that can see some good minutes and he had a good fantasy game. So. If you look at Parker, by Parker, I'm talking about Jabari Parker, not Tony Parker. He's only 
Last game, he saw uh, 16.6 minutes, but uh, Carter basically got hurt last game at the end of the game. So Parker, there's a chance he could see way more than that. So that's a guy I'm looking at playing as my cheap play. Um, and if I do that, then Portis would be my... So Portis, basically, I'm going to use him as a core player. Only 4.6K. I will use him as a core player. And uh, Portis should be seeing some... He might should be in the starting lineup. And should be seen in the 20s to 30. You know, I'm expecting him to be high 20s in minutes to the 30. So he should be a little, playing a little bit of center and forward. So Portis will be my third call. And as you guys already know, I will use Parker unless if somehow, if somehow, then I don't know Parker won't play. And by Parker, I'm talking about Parker. If they say he's not going to play, then I will move Portis as my chief play and use Bagley as my, uh, as my other call player. So Bagley... Will be my other call. So, but for right now, I will use Parker as my cheap play. And if I make any change, I will, of course, come to the channel and post it as a comment on the YouTube channel. So, Parker will be my guy. So, right now, you know, we can do anything that we want to do because we still have a 7.150, 7,150 dollars available for you to do anything that you want to do you can even get two big guy on your team and some of them are not even that expensive you know paul george is a guy i was looking at because he's playing in his own town so why am i be missing that game so and wells got a great matchup kemba kemba walker has a great matchup but i'm gonna go even cheaper guys I'm going all the way to Lau is the guy I'm looking at. But I'm going to go with Ola Zippo. Yes, he's been struggling. But it's just the price. And then the last time he played them, he really had a great game. That was one of the last time he had a great game. He had a, uh, against them, he had a uh, 49 point, basically 50 fantasy points. So uh, let's hope somehow he can get back to be what we are expecting but the last people would be my star guy for for that slate and the thing about it you still have seven kill left who you, where you can play another star if you want so let's try the westbrook let's say if you want to play westbrook you still have 4.6 kill left to do some damages so those are my five players guys um let's go ahead and jump to segment four to check out the cheap list because the cheap list is of course as you guys know uh, i changed the format where i go uh 4.5k rather than 4k and below so uh jelica 4.5k is minutes is his minutes are trending down now so because of bagley back is back he's playing good so and more and more, I think Billy is gonna be playing less minutes. So at 4.5k, we can still get there. I believe he's still starting. Uh, so we can still get there, but you know that's one of the guys you're gonna put a guard on and hoping that's the day he went off. Plumley 4.4k. He's averaging about 21 minutes now. Now that all those guys are back, so it's gonna be hard for him to see minutes. So his minutes probably gonna start trending down too. Yambo 4.2k play about 22 minutes a game and average 120 points per minute. That's actually the guy I'm looking to play tomorrow. So, uh, uh, of course, we all know about Holmes. This guy is very good when it comes for 50 points per minute. But he only play about 19 minutes a game. But he still get there with those minutes. Hart is a guy his price went down. And he's a guy that can go up anytime. Regardless if he's starting or not, Hart is a guy that I'm looking to play. Events 4.4k average over 25 fantasy points a game the last three games and he has been decent, he has been much better. So let's hope he keep it up. And power 3.9k in play, of course, if Kawhi sits, uh, Kawhi Leonard, if he sits, then Chandler, I mean, uh, Powell is a guy that you guys might want to play. And Chandler finally has a decent game 29. 
points, 8 points, 6 points. In the last game, in the last game, so uh, let's hope we keep it up. And Parker, of course, 3.6k with Carter out, he should see some good decent minutes. So, and he should see some decent minutes. And he did great last game, as I showed you guys earlier. So, guys, uh, that's the show for uh, for this slate. Uh, I wish you guys the best. Good luck. Hope everything works out for you guys. You know, subscribe and uh, leave feedback and uh, you know let would like to hear what you guys think about uh, the format that I have I appreciate you guys uh, good luck and uh, you know and you know I had a person that said they like good bird and he did great tonight so a good call on that and as I mentioned on the show also I did like him so uh, he, he was a guy I was on but uh, because of those other bad picks he didn't really help me much but hopefully you guys did really good last night uh, don't spend money that you guys cannot afford to lose uh, you know like comment feedback and uh, turn on your notification if I have anything else that I need to add or change or if there's any news that I think I should post to you guys so I can do that uh, don't, don't spend money that you guys cannot afford to lose and I'm out